Hello everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm here to talk about high school. Well, more, for, more importantly, the most uh, elegant reasons of high school. You know, you meet your girlfriend, you all, you know, just rub around for a little bit. Then you get time to think about it. You cheated on me, you slimy sack of piss. No, I'm just joking. Today we're actually going to be talking about why in the hell they thought it would be good to put this at Walmart. Why is that there? Why, why the hell would you want that there? Why is it there? Take it back down. Why the hell did you put that shit there? No, I'm just kidding. I'm just, we're really going to be talking about age. You're not an OG if you don't remember the first Call of Duties playing them. You're like, man, this is the future. Look at these graphics. Beautiful. But, I can't help but notice that over time, video games just kind of become bland. Like there is no reason to play them. Unless you got friends, of course. Then everything's alright. But, if you don't have friends, well, you're kind of just going to be sad. I guess for the rest of whatever your game you're playing, or if you decide to move on from that game. Well, today I'm going to be talking about it. Do you all remember Ed, Ed, and Eddie? One of my favorite TV shows ever. Besides the Rugrats and the... Well, I guess we might as well just throw Johnny Bravo in there too. And Quick Draw McGraw. Very old, but very cherished characters on Boomerang. But it was a long, long time ago. Like 2009, 2008, somewhere around there. Back when Gary's mod and everybody else was like, holy crap, this is like the best graphics we've ever seen. It's so cool. And like when a computer still ran Windows 7 and 95 was still really acceptable. Now if you're running a Windows 95 computer, my boy, how the hell are you doing that? Hit me up, tell me how the hell you did that. I want to go back. But anyway, I just wanted to talk about this because I feel old. I feel like I'm just the oldest person well, the oldest teenager, and I'm a sophomore. A fucking 17-year-old seven, sophomore. How does that come to be, honestly? After this year, I'll be 18 years old. And that is a lot in itself. I wish I could just stop aging, but at the same time, I wish I didn't. So, back onto this thing. Um, see what other. See, uh, y'all remember Crash Bandicoot, the PlayStation 2, all that when it came out? It's like, oh my god, the PlayStation 2. And like, maybe even a couple years later in 2013 when they released uh, the big one. The Xbox One. And the Xbox One was kind of a game changer for everyone who had one. Because it, it really brought an online situation where you really couldn't play that many games offline. Even the PS4 had that. You can't play games offline sometimes. But you can play like Grand Theft Auto and I'm guessing Subnautica somewhere around there. Comment down below if you want to watch me play Subnautica. <laughs> okay. Well, we, we all do remember South Park and all that, but more onto the consoles. You all still remember playing Call of Duty Black Ops 1 and 2. Didn't really match up. The first one, absolutely loved it. Would play it again if I had it. And would definitely buy more. 
Call of Duty 2, Call of Duty Black Ops 2, completely different, completely different time period, none of the same people, well, I'll take that back, kinda the same people, I guess, you're futuristic, but then you're also not, and it takes place in 2025, and it's almost here, and I don't see any flying cars or anything. I guess the past was wrong. Uh, maybe Elon Musk will get us something cool. Maybe like a cyber banana or something. Feed us to our like a metaverse. You know, give it to the metaverse. <clears throat> but uh, I remember playing Grand Theft Auto online for the PS3 for years. And as soon as they took it down, I was just angry. Because people who actually paid to be on that game and paid for everything else to be put on there, and it said it costed them money to run the servers, it didn't cost you a fucking dime. You were just being a bitch. And you probably just lost a lot of money from doing that. So whoever you are out there, well, whoever Rockstar or whatever the hell, you can fuck off, mister. You can burn and go to hell. Knock you off your fucking high ass pedestal and beat the hell out of you with a damn crowbar. <laughs> but, it may have been a point to where you're old. You just think that you're old and everybody else around you has just kind of changed. <laughs> just kind of changed. But, uh,. I don't know. Do you feel old? If you do, comment about it, I guess. Um, and also, what's your favorite animal? My favorite animal is a fox. Alright, I'll cut to the chase. We're not really... We're not really talking about animals. Don't... It's not about animals, trust me. But games like TF2 and CSGO are kind of just going to be let go. And I don't want to accept it. Because it's my whole childhood playing these video games. Like my first computer was a Windows uh, XP. One of the best computers you'd ever had to start up. And it was just unforgettable. And now we've got these really fast computers <clears throat> technology now has advanced way more it's advanced so far in the last 25 years than ever and I, I hate to say it but yeah these computers are gonna be gone soon it's like you buy a brand new computer and then what the next 10 years it's obsolete completely it's like, oh my god, you're still running that potato? Oh, well, I'm in the metaverse, so that it means you can go fall down the fucking steps and die. And I'm like, oh, damn, okay. It's like, I'm sorry. It's like, take your, old, take your old ass on. Get the hell out of here. But I think in about 10 years, I'll be... Ooh, I really don't want to say that. Oh god, in about 10 years, I'll be like... 27? Oh god, no, I don't want to do that. That's bad. I don't like that. And then 10 more years after that, I'll be 37. Then 10 more years after that, I'll be 47. Oh god, I hate it. Okay, don't even talk about it. Still, though, that's like 30 years. 40 years, something like that. That's kind of scary, though. Not gonna lie, I hope I'm not bald. I hope that YouTube still exists. It probably will. Because YouTube is pretty strong, I guess. And, uh... Well, I guess you're old. On that note, I, uh... I guess I'll see you all in another video. Bye, don't forget... <laughs>